Wednesday night midweek and I am about to head down to an exclusive club in London where my bro DJ Walshy is playing. Never been to this club before so I'm not quite sure how it's all gonna uh, fucking <laughs> Oh look at this guy. What's good, good. What's it? Good. What's going on? Yeah, it's central London right now, about to head down to Circular Swartz. First time I'm gonna be going down, so I don't really know what to expect, but I've heard some good stuff about the place, so yeah, let's check it out. Inside Circular Soir, and one of the first things that I've noticed is that it's a very Instagrammable club. Inside is what you would expect from a Mayfair club. Good vibes, good energy, and good music provided by this guy right here. That's my bro, DJ Walshy. Walshy, baddest DJ. The club is full of pretty women everywhere, but I'll tell you one thing for free. I might look, but I don't touch. Here you can see some of the performers that work at Circular Soir. You could not pay me enough money to dash fire on my body and eat at the same time. Mad thing. But obviously he's a professional, so it's calm. So it's showtime literally as the bottles are coming out. Hey, hey. Quick little action shot of my bro DJ Walshy. Then this random guy all of a sudden decided to video bomb me. But I was here for it because he's good energy and I'm all about that. Don't know what's going on here, but we move. Bottles still popping and it's like that throughout the night, to be honest. The entertainment in this club was on point though, I can't lie. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how I lost my surplus wild virginity. Definitely like the club. Shout out to my bro Walshy. Put on a very, very good set, to be honest. When I do get to go to these, these type of clubs, I like to document it because th there's people that will never get to go to those kind of clubs and they'll never see what it's like. They'll only ever hear of it or maybe see it on social media. So when I'm in a privileged position to be able to go inside, I'd like to give you guys a little bit of an overview for those that won't ever get to go or might not even want to go. See what I mean? Because um, them high-end clubs, they're not for everybody. But yeah, definite vibe. Glad that I went. And now I'm ready to go home from my bed. Fast forward to the weekend when I was DJing in the West End. The Saturday night crowd here were definitely up for a party. In Vauxhall, underneath the arches, heading down to the Bingo Jams event tonight. Gonna be stepping in for my bro DJ Dini G. Um, yeah, I'm actually looking forward to this one. It is a sold out event. Over 200 people are gonna be there proper R&B situation. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it, even though I'm knackered though. But I'm excited, let's go. Bingo Jams London and me and my bro, Mr. A-Star, took to the stage to build the vibe. And I have to say, we kind of nailed that gig. Event time has done and finished. That was a very, very dope event. Very, very dope, had a lot of fun there. Shout out to my Bingo Jam family. Shout out to my bros, Dini G, Robin, thanks for having me. And yes, on to the next event. Which was in Birmingham. One of my favorite towns, to be quite honest. Just checked into my room. As you can see, I was DJing at a brunch earlier in Shoreditch. From Shoreditch, went to Euston. From Euston, come to Birmingham New Street, from New Street Station. Quick bolt to my hotel gonna freshen up, change. I've probably only got about 10 minutes, really, to just freshen up, use the bathroom, get changed, and then head straight down to Bijou tonight for the Reggae Brunch After Dark event. The Reggae Brunch After Dark party was vibes and it was hosted by my bro Dazzle. There were people from different age groups inside, which makes it very challenging for the DJ. But I like a challenge, why? Because ultimately, those kind of experiences is what makes you a better DJ at the end of the day. Sunday daytime and Afro Beats and Brunch and the Reggae Brunch did a joint event down at Vauxhall Beer Garden. The weather was nice and so was the vibes outside and as you can see, the ladies are living their best life. That's my bro DJ Suave and he's a Virgo like me so you know that means he's good peoples and we get along well. These are the kind of moments we live for. The cameraman was all up in his feels. But I get it though, because sometimes music just does that to you. Wine in time and this lady was dutty whining like she wanted Mataran to come and DJ at her birthday party for free. Later on in the afternoon, my bro Dini G took to the deck so you you know it's turn up time. People were flinging their shoulder, doing the drift, busting dance moves. Look at the man them, giving them some real dancehall moves. Hey ladies, the man them turn up too, you know. And that is the end of this week's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe to the channel because it motivates me to make more content like this. And it's definitely something I enjoy doing. So best believe I've got some more vlogs on the way. Until next time, peace.